Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm trying something a little bit different. I'm doing a pocket letter and this was my very first one. So this is a little bit new to me. I'm more of a flip book girl, but I'm really excited. This is for my pen pal, Tina Marie. She is awesome. She's from Canada. Love it. We have a lot of fun. So basically I took this um, sheet from... I bought it from a store, I forget what store, probably Walmart or something. Oh no, it was um, Staples. So I got it from Staples and it's for like sports cards or Pokemon cards or whatever kind of cards. And I cut paper from American Craft, I cut it into um, three, I think it was three and a half by two and a half and cut out a bunch of different colors and patterns and, and uh, yeah, I... So a lot of the cutouts I have here, like the camera and the hello in the middle and the love and the flowers, they're actually from the paper pad. So um, they're just pap papers with really large uh, patterns. And so I just cut them out because why not? That works. Um, and you wouldn't even be able to know. Same with that mason jar and those flowers. Um, and the um, on the top right, those little flags, those are also from it, all scraps and that kind of thing. So pretty excited about that to just use up little things like that, get rid of things from your stash. Um, I had a lot of fun making this. Like I said, this was my first time doing it and it just, I really liked it. I would do definitely do it again. Um, so... This won't be my last time doing it. I was a little bit nervous about like all the different types of patterns, but I think it turned out okay. It was hard to know whether or not I should do same patterns, different patterns, or whatever, but I think it turned out all right. So I used some spray there, and then I took like the shimmer spray, and then I took it out and like did paint splatters with it. I labeled some of the pockets, not all of them. The one that she gave me, my pen pal gave me, had labels on all of them, and I loved that. But I just couldn't find the right spots. It just looked awkward on mine, so I couldn't quite do that. But I think that'll be okay because you can just turn it over and see the gifts there, so I don't think it's a huge deal. But anyway, so um, I, yeah, I labeled some of them, not all. Um, what else here? I put those pearls from Dollar Tree on there, and it's a Simple Stories I Am collection. I use a few stickers from it. Really cute. I didn't really, now looking at it, you kind of see some things that are sort of awkward or stand out that you wish you kind of didn't do. But sometimes I think with our mail, we judge it too hard. Just love what you make. Love love being creative and, and don't be so harsh on yourself. Because I'm seeing these little things now that I wish I wouldn't have. But I don't know. I still think in the end it turned out pretty cute. And I really hope my pen pal likes it. On that tag, I'm putting some more spray and some stamps. And then I'm going to put some washi tape. But I'm just leaving it to dry. And I think what I'm about to do is fill it up. It's hard not to decorate it really crazy because with flip books, there's just so much space. And with these, you only have a small two and a half by three and a half space to work with. And they're all separate. So I found it a little bit challenging, but I love to challenge my creativity. I think that really um, helps you to just experiment, try new things, and advance yourself in creativity. So I don't think it's quite a bad thing. But it was definitely out of my comfort zone a little bit. So I, w I had watched many YouTube videos on pocket letters and how to do it. And so I tried to learn a lot from others. And um, I kind of stayed safe with the pink theme because I, uh, I know how to do, I know how to work p p the pink colors. So uh, I kind of stuck with that. So play it safe. So I'm just filling it with random things, washi tape, letter, tag, um, handmade 
embellishments there, those circles that I made, uh, paper clips, little jewels, sticky notes, just whatever I think my pen pal will like. It's just such an awesome way. I don't know, I really like about the pocket letter that the letter also is where all of the things, all of the goodies go. And I know this is the same in the flip book, but like, I don't know, it's so like compact and wonderful and it folds up so nicely into an envelope. It's great. So I really, I really like the pocket letter. Okay, well, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and uh, we'll talk soon. Thanks. Bye.